This is where the earth tubes enter my mechanical room. I made all the ducts out of transparent polycarbonate. It was 90 degrees outside a couple hours ago, but now it's closer to 85. The 8-inch ducts are bringing in air at 51 Fahrenheit and 92% humidity. The 6-inch ducts moderate a little less, so they're at 53 degrees. The probes for these are down in front of the tubes. Inside the tubes is probably about 100% humidity and condensing on the walls. As the air warms up again, relative humidity automatically drops, but I also run it through this dehumidifier. At the moment, the dehumidifier is just sampling. Oh, it turned on because the humidity sensor decided it needed to. This other probe is on the duct on the way out to the west side of the house. It's showing 55 degrees and 81% humidity. But the air warms as it passes through the floor and comes out at 68 degrees and 23% humidity, according to the tables. This other probe is in the ducts for the east side of the house. It says 58 degrees and 75% humidity. But that's falling because the dehumidifier turned on. Actually, the humidity is falling very quickly. Eventually, the temperature will also go up a degree or two because the compressor on the dehumidifier puts off a little heat of its own. There it goes, 59 degrees, now 60. Checking the thermostat upstairs, and it's 68 in this room. It's going around to the other side of this wall, and it's 70. This room has large sunny windows and no earth cover yet, so it's always the warmest room in the house. The bedroom wing down that way is underground and a cool 65 degrees all the time. Here's Sherry's working hard laying tile. Let's go outside. It's hot and muggy out here. I like to show how far the earth tubes go from the house down to the entry box. We used 250 feet of pipe for each. Here's the view up the hill from the box. Eventually we'll bury this and make it look like a hobbit house with a round door, etc. But for now... Temperature in here shows over 90 degrees, but that may be because the sunlight is partially hitting this thermometer. These are the earth tube inlets. When I have time, I'll put screens and furnace filters on them. These four alone suck in enough air to exchange all the air in the house several times per hour. But I also have another set of four on the other side of the house, but I haven't even hooked those up to the ducts yet. It's too hot out here, I'm going back inside. 